Okay, if you look real close, we got the MSD box in. If you're running a tachometer, where's that? Make sure you hook up your wire. I'm going to show you the wire diagram. Make sure you hook that uh, tack wire in there. This wire here, this wire loom here that's built in, that is for your, uh, your uh, control module and your distributor, okay? Electronic module. I got all the wires run. If you look real nice, they're nice and uh, wire loomed up. I got wire ties on all the wires. They come up through the frame and then come around just like so and up the transmit. Got all that done, we're off our back, we're off the cold floor. Now what we do, we go to our distributor. Uh, it's really best if I just wire it up, it's gotta be real hard to get in there and you see the car we're working on here. And I'm gonna try to do this without removing the hood, so of course I gotta let the car down. Let me get the hood up here. Uh, as you see in there, there's our distributor. Okay, and we're gonna be removing a lot of uh, wires off of this. All these wires down here will be removed. We're gonna take our module out of the distributor. That's how this works on a GM distributor. And uh, we're gonna be rewiring that up. All our wires are down in here. Now here's our, that actually runs the uh, ignition controller there, which I'm gonna show you on our uh, instructions here in a minute. It's easier to see that. So I'm gonna wire that up. I'll get everything working good, and uh, wow, that car's looking really nice in there. I like that. So all basically what you got to do, this is what you're going to have in your HEI distributor. You need to take that out, throw it away, or keep it for later use. Follow the instructions thoroughly, okay? It's very simple. If you use this wire harness, do not use the white wire, wherever the white wire went. Okay, where is our white wire? Yeah, there it is. Don't use the white wire if you use this. The white wire is for points, and the purple and green wire are for magnetic pickup triggers. Follow the directions, it goes through your distributor. As you see, here's a close up view of what you're looking at. You're gonna remove your uh, magnetic pickup trigger module, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the wire harness that's supplied, which is right in here with these wires, and you're gonna take your little grommet, and you're gonna take your little wire hold downs. Okay, get those out of the fucking picture. Where did the other one go? There it is. And you're just gonna follow the directions and hook your wires up proper. This is actually a plug and play situation, okay? That's how easy MSD is. And I'm gonna tell you something else about MSD. If you have D ignition, uh, HEI ignition, okay? We're swapping it over. It's gonna be nice. It's gonna run and hopefully, Pray to God, okay, it will fix Gary's problem. He spent a lot of money on this car. Uh, that's right, safety all the time, buddy. Uh, and, you know, his car is looking beautiful. Let's get him on the road, get him happy. Okay, this should fix his problem that he's having with the foul plugs and the cold starts and everything else. If you're having those problems, Get an MSD 6A, you don't need a 6AL unless you're racing your car. I don't know why they sent that to us, okay, but we're gonna go ahead and keep it now anyway, all right? I was supposed to get a 6A instead of a 6AL, but that's irrelevant. It doesn't help you like this little series on MSD. There it is right there. MSD spark box controller, uh, whatever the fuck you wanna call it. It's a nice box, it's a good box, it's a workable box. Use the box.
Ice and tea, ghost and tea, best chest tea. Here we go again to learn some more stuff from you, no clue. Charlie the Cloud is here to stay. And my friend Pete, your friend Pete, last chest Pete, gonna show you how to do it right. <laughs> Hee 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 h